Hello and welcome to Shelter Mode, the premier YouTube channel for shipping container living. In this video, we bring to you a two story shipping container house ideal for a narrow lot designed using four 40 foot shipping containers. Stay tuned to find out more about these modern container house design. If you are looking for modern floor plans for container homes, a weekly update on case studies for most influential shipping container homes from around the world, plus detailed articles from our building guide for shipping container homes, feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel for these and more weekly videos. Check out our website sheltermod.com for lots of free resources, modern floor plans and blueprints. If you like our videos plus our valuable content on shipping container living, feel free to support our channel on Patreon through the link in the description below. Without further ado, let's get started. Design concept. This modern shipping container house is designed using four 40 foot shipping containers. There are two 40 foot containers on the ground floor and an additional pair of two 40 foot shipping containers comprising the first floor level. The shipping containers have been stuck on top of each other to create a two story modern container house. Foundation design. The shipping containers sit on a steel pier foundation. The containers have been elevated off the ground to keep the containers away from moisture. The raised foundation level is also ideal to create an outdoor deck and an elevated entrance porch. Design brief. The two shipping containers on the ground floor level accommodates the following salient features. From the elevated entrance porch into a recessed main entrance door, you get into the main entrance lobby. From the entrance lobby, you can access a small closet on your right hand side. On the left hand side of the entrance lobby, there is a small home office calm study room. We have a half bathroom in between the study room and a small laundry room. From there, you are able to access the single flight staircase that leads you up to the first floor level, or you proceed ahead into an open plan living space. The open plan living space accommodates a spacious L-shaped kitchen with adequate overhead storage and a horizontal slit window next to the sink space for ample daylighting. There is a small dining table that can sit up to six comfortably. On the extreme end, next to the full height sliding glass windows that have been fitted in the open space comprising the original container cargo doors, there is an intimate lounge space fitted with sofa seats. The lounge space is also fitted with an additional sliding glass door on the side for adequate daylighting. On the first floor level, once you land into the staircase lobby, from the staircase lobby, you are able to access three bedrooms all accommodated on the first floor level of this design. We have a small guest bedroom right immediately after you turn from the landing space. We have a big shared bedroom 
with two queen size bed and an adequately sized wardrobe on the extreme left there is a spacious master bedroom with a mini lounge and a full line of adequate wardrobe storage there is also a private bathroom there is also access to an outdoor sitting area which has been created by the original container cargo doors which have been used in an open position to create nice Juliet balconies. On the structure and modification, most of the interior container walls on the ground floor level have been cut out to create an open plan living space and therefore additional reinforcement will be required to take care of the structural integrity of the two shipping containers. When it comes to windows and doors, most of them are optimal in size and they do not require any additional modification or reinforcement. When it comes to interior design, you are encouraged to adopt a minimalist design where furnishing your shipping container house avoids clutter as much as possible. You can use space saving furniture ideas like Murphy beds or sofa beds for transformational use of one space for more than one function. The interior space is also painted light to at least make the space appear brighter and bigger, helping to kill the claustrophobic feel of living in a shipping container box. You also need to insulate your shipping container project because they are made out of steel and therefore to create a comfortable indoor living environment adequate insulation should be used depending on the climate where you intend to build. On the outdoors and exterior design we've provided adequate outdoor seating space on the ground floor level whereby the lounge space spills out onto a generous outdoor deck creating that seamless interface of the indoor outdoor relationship on the first floor level we have two juliet balconies providing adequate outdoor seating space for the master bedroom if you have a small or a narrow lot and you're wondering on how to develop it then this particular design will give you a solution to make good use of your narrow plot. With just four 40 foot shipping containers, you are able to create a spacious family house with three bedrooms and adequate facilities for comfortable living. You are encouraged to check out our website sheltermod.com for inspiration of various shipping container house designs that you've managed to do over the years. If you like this video, as usual, give it a thumbs up and feel free to share it. Remember to subscribe and see you in the next video. If you love shipping container homes or you are planning on building one, our YouTube channel is a one-stop shop for a complete guide on how to design, how to build, how to insulate, and a collection of hundreds of blueprints for container homes designs. In addition, we also cover case studies of the best homes made from shipping containers from around the world. For this and more, Feel free to subscribe and remember to click on the bell so that you don't miss out on any of our amazing weekly videos. You can also contact us on our website sheltermode.com or follow us on social media platforms through the links in the description below.